In February, we had a video about Google shutting down the third-party interface. It will affect your Google Voice service. This is a follow-up to that uh, video. So briefly, let's review what is this shutdown is about. Basically, you have public switching network, which provide you a number, a telephone number. Anyone providing a phone number need to pay some fees, so it's not free. But Google decided to waive that fee for you and providing a bridge between the public switching network to an internet voice over IP based network. For example, Google provided you a phone number, Google Voice number, and this is a, a example incoming phone call. If someone dialed this number, there's an incoming phone call, and Google Voice service will provide a forwarding service. For example, forwarding to other telephone numbers, a multiple of them, as well as forwarding to the IP-based network. And this is the particular interface we're interested in. This is a protocol called XMPP. But Google announced at this stage is cutting off this line. Originally, devices such as OB Heist would connect to this third party interface, but after this stage, it's going to disappear. So what are the solutions once this is cut off? You still have other connection, for example, Google's service or to other telephone number. For example, you can forward to your cell phone, to your landline or to your other phone numbers. You still can do that. If you want any service on this side, what are the other possibilities? One, you can use Google service, but then it will be on Google's schedule which device they will support. So you can not test other third-party products. So you may have to wait until this day to test. Another possibility is use either pay or some free voice over IP service. Suppose you have another voice over IP provider provide you a phone number. You surely once receive this incoming call, you can forward to that one and this particular company to forward this voice to an IP address in this domain. Now, this pass sometimes free, sometimes not. For example, currently this company is providing a phone number and forward in this direction for free. You may find others. So the next question is what to do with outgoing phone call. And you have a, a Google Voice number that is not going to disappear. Of course, this is a free for incoming phone calls and it's not free for dialing going out. But you can get a run of this by opening a Google web interface and that web interface will dial two lines. It first will dial this line, the voice over IP, for example, the OB high device. Once you pick up this device, the Google's interface will dial a second line, which is the outgoing line. That way it connects the two lines from the OB high device to the person you want to dial. Disadvantage of this is you have to open your browser to make an outgoing call. If you don't want to turn on your computer to use a browser to make outgoing phone call, you could investigate service that providing outgoing dialing for free. There are some services but a close for a new sign up as we approach to this deadline. We'll investigate to see whether there's an, any new voice over IP service that open for a new sign up. Until next time, thank you.